Imagine standing at the edge of a black hole, that mysterious abyss where space and time fold into themselves. At its heart lies the singularity, an infinitely dense point where the known laws of physics collapse. But what if this point, instead of being the end of everything, is actually the beginning of something entirely new? This is the tantalizing idea behind black hole cosmology. The possibility that black holes might not just devour matter and energy, but could actually give birth to new universes. According to this theory, every black hole could act as a seed, a cosmic womb, cradling the birth of a baby universe. As matter collapses inward, crushed beyond recognition, the singularity might push outward on the other side, expanding into its own space-time, disconnected from ours. To us, it's just an inescapable void, but to whatever lies beyond, it could be an entire universe blossoming into existence. Think of our own universe. Could it too have been born from a black hole in another cosmos? Some theorists suggest that the Big Bang, that explosive expansion that set everything in motion, may have been the result of such a process. In this view, universes are not singular or unique. They are part of an endless cosmic tree, each black hole a branch sprouting its own universe, creating a vast multiverse beyond anything we can currently observe. Of course, all this remains purely speculative. We have no way yet to peek beyond the event horizon, no instruments to glimpse what happens deep within a black hole's core. Our mathematics breaks down at the singularity, leaving us with equations that hint at possibilities but offer no definitive answers. And yet the idea persists, captivating cosmologists and philosophers alike. If black holes really do spawn new universes, it raises profound questions. Do the laws of physics change with each new cosmos? Are there countless realities where stars burn differently? Where life may or may not exist, branching off endlessly beyond our reach? For now, we stand on the shore of this cosmic ocean, gazing into the black depths, wondering, are we looking at an end or at an unimaginably vast beginning?